Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome to something a bit new. We're going to start another playthrough today as one of the Araby factions, as the Aswad Skiffins, Skiffins and, and um, as Fatandira here. So we're going to start with some camel riders with bows, a war elephant, and a giant scorpion. Of course, playing on hard, hard guys, and we are doing this on the Vortex map. A few little bits and pieces these guys have. They hate the Bretonian Crusader Kingdoms. I wonder why. They've got a bizarre mechanic to buy items. And a well-rounded roster with cheap infantry, magic, and dangerous creatures. Though morale is difficult to maintain. Uh, no desert attrition. Enables recruitment to certain Tomb King units. Uh, okay. And extra relations with Tomb Kings. Uh, so and she gets extra replenishment, ambush chance, and uh, upkeep. For certain new reduction of certain units, okay, and obviously she is a ranged hero. As you can probably tell from her picture and the fact she's holding a bow. Um, again, I've not really played this faction yet, yet, so I don't know exactly how they're gonna work. So that's something we're gonna be finding out together. Literally, I've this is the first time I've actually loaded into. Well, no, it's a lie. So the second time I've loaded in, I literally loaded in to check it worked. So touch what it worked this time. Other than that, this is literally the first time I'll actually be playing this faction, guys. If you are new to my channel, obviously like and subscribe, please, if you do want to see more. And chuck comments down below on where you think I should be doing, what you think I'm doing wrong. If you've played these guys, feedback is more than welcome, because I like jumping into these things without really knowing the factions at all. And I don't know the lore, so by all means, give us a lore dump in the chat as well. Okay, so here we are. We started with Qatar. Uh, obviously, we're going to want to take Numas early on. We're going to want to get this entire th area. And we've got ugh, nasties in the mountains over here, which potentially we're going to want to pressure towards. Um, nice. We're starting with uh, Hashassin. So an assassin there. Um, and obviously our, our troop with a war elephant. And a nasty enemy army just there. With chaos knights, oof! Lady of the Phoenix Court. You don't, you don't sound knight. Onward. Hmm. No. I mean. Ooh. Aim shot. Oh no, I've already got that. Okay. Um. So let's have a look. She gets a war horse. She gets a secure. So a flying bird later on. For rest, obviously, she gets some nice ranged abilities, and let's have a look through this. I'll look through a lot of these later, because obviously we're going for route march first. Oh. And uh, making yourself good in melee is potentially good, but she shouldn't really be getting into melee, so obviously we're going to start buffing up our armies first as well. So a bit more morale, especially as morale. For some of my units, it's certainly a bit lower. Uh... Doing a cheeky save. I should get garrison forces here. Um, so this is going to be a tough fight. I always fight these first fights, though. If they're, they're, they're somewhere like that, I always fight it straight away. They would have come and attacked me anyway with those odds with against the Grand Scrythian Coalition. Uh, obviously with the Aswan Scrythian. So that's obviously my... I'm overthrowing him as a Fasandira here. Uh, we want to sit back so we can get my reinforcements in before we do anything. Nice! That's a really good model! Now, my understanding is they can't actually add models, so these are based off things, but I like! I mean, obviously these will be based off the Tomb King ones, as you can see. Um, but I don't know if that's completely the case, or if people have managed to add models in yet. So we are quite a. Mm. We are ready. Okay. What I probably want to do is keep them moving early on. Princess, show us the foe. Okay, and these guys are going to sit back while the other things come in. I want to pepper their elephants to start with. Fact, yeah. Our weapons are yours. 
I suspect the Chaos Knights are probably a bit tougher than us. Let's rephrase that. There is no way I'm as tough. We've got Chakra Slaves, some more Bowmen, and we have some Knights. Okay. Some Arabian Knights. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't laugh at that. That is a terrible joke. So these guys, slaves, are obviously going to be my front line. What do you bid? Reserve group? Go. At once. Go. And these guys are going to sit behind to support. Let's have a look. These are heavy anti-infantry, heavy anti-infantry. So, yeah. At speed. Show us the foe. I command Oops. in your stead. Taking position. Quick march. Sigma calls! Awaiting orders! We obey! Show us the foe! Um, she's actually got good anti-large. They are enraged. Right, let's hit these guys from three angles to try and really reduce them. I'm putting her on them because I don't particularly want these guys getting overly engaged. Ranged, all help on these knights. Oh, I do have some spears. I missed them. Oh, I, I missed some extra units I had come in. Oh, bugger. In which case, everything else can actually fall back a little bit. Come on, another quick charge in there. Our are yours. Orders. Take the ground. Perfect, right, I want you guys to pull behind. I want the range to stay on them until they are completely broken out. Because they coming back would be painful. Okay, you can both target him. Something's flying above me. That's a worrying sign. Elephant in. And scorpions in there. Oh, my assassin can actually charge in now. I'm going to make fairly short work of these units with the scorpions and the elephant. Oh, back in there. God damn it. That's why they started doing that. I want you guys to fall back a little bit. Oh, wow. That was a brutal... However, we shredded them there. My assassin has, is, however, running. Let's use our aim shot. All of my range can skirmish. Okay, so they're both ranged heroes. That's fine. I think we've got them here. God damn it. So their Chaos Knights have done a lot of damage to us, as I would expect from Chaos Knights, to be fair. You're going to pull into the range. Your guys are slamming into there. Sorry, you can charge there. Let's have a look at these Arabian Knights. They look funky. Oh, come on! Nice! I'll take it. 
a close victory. I'm happy with that. As I, we have to always fight that first one. I, I, it's a point of pride, effectively, to fight that first one. We're actually in a nice corner of a map here, because we can definitely corner camp here. The other people around us are going to be doing their own things, though the Tomb King's not so much the um, Vortex. What I want to avoid is too much, too many Skaven interactions. Obviously, we want to make the desert ours long run through either Alliance or Blood. Um, Rapance is going to have to probably be one of our biggest threats, actually, with her heavy cavalry army. Um, no, I'm, I'm quite happy with how we did that. Um, I definitely want some more infantry in this army, because this army is very infantry light at the moment. I, it has none. But I think we shredded them. The Chaos Warriors didn't take much damage. Oh, and we've got a slave. We're a slave economy faction. Okay. Lady of the Phoenix Court. Can I offer assistance, princess? Orders? And I start with no military buildings. Okay, that's Add not good. Hmm. Nope. Extra weapon strength. Uh, extra speed for the entire army is always nice. Uh, I don't really have too many of them yet, so I'm just going to go up here. I'm going to give her hard to hit, because a bit of melee defense is always useful. Princess of the Asteroid. Okay, this could be a tricky start, because I suspect you're not meant to start on this map. Um, what's our tech tree like? Um, obviously we're a slave economy, which does make things interesting. Especially though they don't seem to have any buildings which deal with slaves. Ooh, now I like that. So you can get access to a lot of the other buildings. And the Grand Bazaar. Uh, it is just, you know, what you'd expect it to be. Protect our vault one. Okay. Hmm. Ooh, pure breeds for boss elephants, rank and file, uh, public order and research or growth. Ooh, that's really good, actually. 20% armor for all cavalry units. Archer damage for now, because that is a major part of my army. I'm kind of wondering if I should have knocked something over to build a recruitment building, but we'll see where we go. I serve the Phoenix King. Um, I say that. Yeah, no, I can get that. So I can get that building out. Um, you may approach. I'm gonna wait one more turn for replenishment before we go hit them again. And then we're going to build up a little bit and advance. They are slowly dying on my border there, which is perfect for us, actually. It's who I take on first, and it's probably going to be the vampires. Can I offer assistance? Duty calls. Ooh, so this, Golden Idol, ooh, Nekaran Excavation. Golden Idols, uh, ooh, that's... Chance to uncover something, or maybe to start to cover something much worse. Oh God, that doesn't sound good. But for now, we're getting this, just to give ourselves some rank and file troops. Highborn. As so we fight. This is gonna be a bit of a trickier one because we don't have the backup, but I'm not worried. The only thing which is really worried is Oh, they have a vamp they have a Chaos Lord now. Yeah Oh god. <clears throat> but nothing else here is really worrying. Vigoro Hel Hellreek is going to die. A horrible, horrible death. 
as my assassin and my lord fill them full of archers. Um, let's be honest, my uh, ranged are going to have fun. And my monstrous units are going to have lots of fun, sorry. Our weapons are yours! Guide my bow! We are ready! Yes, sir! Attack! Awaiting orders! What do you bid? Take aim! Awaiting orders! I'm um, gonna move them up there! Okay, you can start falling back. Let's start peppering the Chaos Knights. Okay, this is good. I don't think their elephants are going to last long there. Let's pull my camels back a bit. You guys can charge their archers. All of my range can stay on them. We're battering through them. These guys are going to make very short work here. The Chaos Knights are probably the bigger thing threat, but these guys are actually armor-piercing as well, so it's Chaos Warriors, sorry. Perfect. Let's get all of my ranged focusing on their wizard. I will admit those Chaos Knights are holding quite nicely. Chaos Warriors, sorry. Hit the elephant. Everything back up onto that. Okay, they are utterly broken. Let's charge back onto the hero unit. We are taking a bit more damage this time because we got a bit less to distract them, but we are. We're, we're, that's it. They're done. Did that scorpion just disintegrate one? You guys can pull off so we can just shoot at it at her at him. Standing by Feel him full of arrows, not that it matters, they've lost at this point. Oh, it's disappeared now. I think he had an arrow in his eye. Nice. Nice, solid battle there. We lost 15 units and we were a far smaller force than them, to be fair. She's not that much smaller. Um, that's our first threat dealt with. Um, interesting use set of units. Um, obviously, the monstrous units 
are giving us our strength at the moment. Uh, without them, we would be struggling, but that's why you have monstrous units. That said, my monstrous units didn't get that many more kills than everything else, so... Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Hmm... I obviously need to uh, build up a bit before we do anything else. But yeah, we'll see. Um, so to start with, obviously I can't say too much, but it looks like an interesting, another interesting faction, which is good. Lady of the Phoenix Court. Protector of Ulthorn. On my way. I serve the Phoenix King. Lady of Ulthorn. Garrisoning. Right, uh, melee defense to start with. Ooh. No, shoot to kill. Does my assassin gets a camel and a better camel later on? Nice, okay. And that, guys, is where we're gonna leave it for today. Uh, my first episodes are always a bit shorter, so. Don't worry, they're not usually 20 minutes. My short first ones are just works better for YouTube algorithms, I find. Um, as mentioned, if you have seen this and you want to see more, please do like and subscribe. Obviously, modded playthrough, which I think I forgot to say at the start. Link to the mod down below in the description, guys. Uh, it's using the OVN Lost Factions mod. Please go check that out. I'm doing a whole load of other things on OVN at the moment, so check all that out as well. Absolutely fantastic mod, guys. Really adds effectively another game's worth of content to the game. I'm absolutely flabbergasted by a team of about 15 people, from my understanding. So amazing work to all of them. And a big thank you for doing this. As always, a massive thank you to everybody for watching, but a massive, massive thank you to my patrons as well. You really do help make all this possible. Uh, link to that down below in the description as well, or you can click join here on YouTube. It does the same thing, but through YouTube. Other than that, guys, as always, thank you very much for watching. Cheers, all.